hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of a if we have square root of 3 plus square root of a is equals to 3 and we solve this problem for the values of a so uh, here in order to find the value of a we first need to eliminate this square root sign from a for this we move this square root of 3 to the right hand side and after moving this it will be written as square root of a is equal to 3 minus square root of 3 and further in the next step uh, in order to remove this square root sign we need to take a squaring on both of the sides so when we will take squaring it will be written as in this form and now here further we have this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here a is equals to uh, here we have 3 minus square root of 3 and its whole square so we write this term as it is here and further in the next step we use here the nice algebraic formula to solve the right hand side so uh, in the right hand side uh, we use this nice formula if we have a minus b whole square is equals to a square minus 2 times of a b plus b square we need uh, these steps because of we write our answer into the simplified form okay that's why we, we need more simplification here you see that uh, this term is our a and this term is our b so we just substitute these two values of a and b into the below formula after substituting these values uh, our above equation is written as a is equals to this is first we have a square the value of a is 3 square minus 2 times of a b so a is 3 and b is square root of 3 plus b square so b is square root of 3 and its whole square and in the next step we have a is equals to this 3 square becomes 9 minus this is 2 times 3 becomes 6 times of square root of 3 plus this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here 3 only and uh, further when we add these two terms this will becomes 9 plus 3 becomes 12 minus 6 times of square root of 3 so this is the value of a so you see that uh, in this question we get only one root of the given equation and that is 12 minus 6 times of square root of 3 okay so uh, here uh, we need to verify uh, this root and we check that is this root with a solution or is this root with that strange root so for verification of the roots we need to copy down given question statement here it is square root of 3 plus square root of a is equals to 3 this is the our given question statement and now we need to substitute the value of a into the left hand side so when you put this value here it will becomes square root of 3 plus this is square root of a and the value of a is this one so we substitute this value here and it will becomes 12 minus 6 times of square root of 3 is equals to 3 or not this is the our claim okay so we need a little bit a simplification into the left hand side and we easily convert our left hand side is equals to 3. So for this we need to uh, do we need to do uh, these steps backward okay you just do these steps backward in order to verification of these roots. So here first you see that this is 12 minus 6 times square root of 3 and we write this we write this 12 as 9 plus 3 it means that we break this 12 as 9 plus 3 and at the uh, if we move more backward then you, we write this 9 as 3 square and we write this 3 as square root of 3 and its whole square okay so we move these backward steps and we can write this term into the into this square root this whole square root form so for this we need more simplifications and it will be written as square root of 3 plus this is uh, 12 minus 6 times of square root of 3 and we write this 12 as 9 plus 3 minus this is 6 we write 6 as 2 times 3 times of square root of 3 and here we claim that is this equals to 3 or not we break this 3 uh, this 6 as 2 times 3 okay so now here we uh, need um, 
to rewrite this equation as in this form this is square root of 3 times this is 9 we write it as 3 square plus this is 3 so we write square and square root at the same time of this 3 and it will be written as square root of 3 and its whole square minus here we have this is 2 times 3 times square root of 3 and this is equals to 3 or not here we this is the our verification and now here further in the next step we have this is square root of 3 plus this is square root of here we have a square plus b square minus 2 times of a and b so when we combine all of these terms it will be written as 3 minus square root of 3 and its whole square and we check that is this equals to 3 or not okay further in the next step we have this is square root of 3 plus this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here 3 minus square root of 3 is equals to 3 so further we have this is the negative term this is the positive term are gone and we get here 3 is equals to 3 so this shows that the value of a is equals to 12 minus 6 times square root of 3 is satisfied over this question statement so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos